Good morning, everyone. Dr. Vicki here speaking to you from the Seeds of Transformation Healing Center. It is a Saturday, the 16th of March, and the moon is in Gemini. And we continue with the moon in Gemini to get information. Uh, there has been a plethora of information out there. Um, a lot of readers and psychics are getting a lot of information um, and so you might be noticing everybody's jumping on and and uh, and their guides are talking to them and they're talking to us <laughs> one of the things that uh, I think is important is um, first of all we can depend on our own uh, information coming through uh, you don't have to be a famous psychic to get psychic information and uh, one of the things that, um, well, let me talk about what's happening today. Uh, we did have an early morning sextile of the moon to the north node, meaning that the information that's coming through now will help us to decide which direction we want to move in with the north node in the sign of Aries, which is about action um, initiatory action and uh, perhaps action we haven't taken before there's always uh, this sense of newness and adventure and a little bit of trepidation or perhaps a lot of bit of trepidation uh, with Aries but we tend to uh, feel so impelled uh, in the Aries energy and Mercury the ruler or the dispositor of this Gemini moon and uh, is in Aries and so our mind is quick our mind is quite connected um, the challenge now is to not get emotionally overwrought by all the information coming in it's important with data as is the data coming in at this time to sort of step back from the data not to make assumptions about the data not to assume we know where things are going uh, because again, it is information. It's um, it's like assuming you're going to know where your what your destination is like when you're still on the road getting there. You never quite know, and so I would say follow the directions that you're being given. Uh, of course, uh, if you can depend on your own sense of things uh, with the Aries North Node. Um, it may even it it may be more helpful to you but if you need guidance there's plenty of folks out there giving guidance and you know this has been going on long enough we know who's accurate we know who's uh saying things uh i i don't actually know who these people are who are just saying things to to rile us up because i don't listen to those people <laughs> i don't even know who they are uh of course, I try to use the stars to determine direction, um, as it were, a stargazer that I am, and uh, fellow stargazers as you are, including uh, people who appreciate the sound of the birds and the newness of the of the energy coming in. It's it's not quite spring, but you can feel it. You can feel it here. Things are springing up. And once spring rolls around, of course, things get a lot quicker. The sun goes into Aries, and uh, we have this Aries um, um, sorry, eclipse. Thank you very much, spirit. <laughs> My brain's like, you know that word, right? What is it? Eclipse. Speaking of eclipse, I... Um, I'm going to be on Jen Lin's channel uh, on the 18th, which is m Monday, I think. Yep, Monday. Uh, I believe we're doing a live, but I'm not sure if we're doing a live or if it's going to be taped and she's going to put it out. But I'm pretty sure. Uh, I, I definitely know we're doing something on Monday. And uh, we discuss talking about these eclipses that are uh, that are here and and we're really in the midst of already. The first uh, official eclipse occurs uh, on the 25th of March, 
which was the original date of the uh, money laundering thing. But they've decided that if they want, they can, you know, give, they'll give him another month for whatever reasons. Um, Alvin Bragg is not um, an idiot. And uh, I think he's got him dead to rights and it's just a matter of time to to get him there it's like if it, i think if it was a case that was uh you know is it possible could it be is it is that a, even a maybe they win maybe they won't win they're gonna win they're gonna win and so uh that's what i think about that i i think you know people getting all upset about it is you know, there's going to be plenty of other things to get upset about if you want to go that way. So I say, uh, see what's going on. Glean the information you got to glean. And uh, live your life to the best of your ability and shine your own light. Because that's the only light you really have uh, any kind of control over. And, um, and perhaps we have to take the controls off the light and just shine it. Just be ourselves. Just do what we do. Uh, invest your energy in what you want to see and the things that matter to you. Perhaps that's the lesson of the Aries North Node. All right, guys. Have yourself a wonderful day. Um, let's see. Anything else happening? I was <laughs> very ambitious yesterday morning because I had a little time off. I said, oh, I have a day off. I'm going to get so much done. I did get a lot done, but it was all those things I couldn't get done because I was so busy doing other things like laundry. Well, no, this is what I did yesterday. Laundry and cleaning and organizing and catching my breath and going and get groceries. <laughs> and by the time the end of the day rolled around, I couldn't get off the couch. So... <laughs> We'll see what I can do about getting. I have there's quite a few things in my head that's rolling around as far as doing readings for. I just I just can't say if I, I'm not gonna. Uh, let's just say if something comes out, you'll be pleasantly surprised, and if it doesn't, you will be disappointed because I promised. So that's what I want to say. Take care, everyone. Have a great day. Namaste.